welcome back to Mount and Blade Warband Blood and Steel. Now, why, why did I say ho ho ho? It's not Christmas. I'm not Santa Claus. I don't believe in Santa Claus. And to be honest, I think people that lie to their children have a serious problem. But what's what's wrong with making a onomatopoeia of laughing? You know. Go ho 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 ha 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 hee 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 hoo 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 hee 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 you know it, it's uh it's fun to do that from time to time so I just did it so um you may remember from last episode we're still under siege this army of enemies I don't even know where they're coming from at this point just endless endless battle we can only hope that we last them out but of course that's a fat chance you know it's a fat chance that we'll win because they're just coming wave after wave and what do we have to greet them with perhaps i should sing a song now um at this point in my uh channel i don't think i've actually sung a full song before I know I have rapped a couple times. I wouldn't say it's high quality rap, but uh, perhaps my singing might be better. But uh, let's uh, find out. Um, Mountain Blade Warband, Blood and Steel, the musical, I guess. Wait here for some time. And perhaps I might not sing, I don't know. The battle has dawned on this day. One after another, we enter these. But now I must go to fight the enemy when they come to us. You see, not the best. Um, I haven't prearranged any music or lyrics, so I have no idea of what to sing at this point but I'm hoping I'll get some idea soon in the meantime I'll fire shot after shot I fire at the enemy they come and come wave after wave what can I do when they come for me the enemy has mighty steel weapons but I fire shot after shot with my handgun. It's a handgun! It's a handgun! It's a handgun! It's a handgun! I have a handgun and I fire it at all my enemies. But what shall I say when they come and fight me to the death? So this enemy has come. From all the lands, the badgers go marching down our streets. Oh, when the badgers come marching in, I must say that I am sad. Because I hope that all our lives might be spared. But the badgers, they have no mercy. They have no mercy for all my men. They choose to come, raid and pillage to enforce the laws of the nobility. But I must say that I disagree with... Oh. The power of the nobility. Because they have taken advantage. Don't tell me. No! Charge. Oh, well, that was easy. That was easy. I could say. Now, if you are wondering, I'm not intoxicated by anything. Uh, because, well, because I don't like getting intoxicated, you know? Lose your mind a little bit. It's not best. And to be honest, why? Why? Why lose your self-control? 
once more I am doing this uh, flying thing, I'm flapping my wings. Can I actually fire this while I am floating? Indeed I can. Well, that's uh, good to know. I'll uh, end this uh, battle here. We lost a cannoneer. It's not the best. Would have preferred to lose someone less valuable, but of course, cannoneers cost a lot, so in theory, all for the best, you know? But of course, you can't really say that about your soldiers. I mean, that's just a bad thing to say. You, you go out into town, uh, into a military town, um, a, an army base, for example, and you're all, oh, this is a list of casualties, but, oh yeah, good news, because there's less casualties, now there's more money to pay you. I mean, you can't really say that. It's true, but you can't say it. You can't just uh, discard someone's life like that. But, uh, I guess that's the way it is. It's a matter of fact in this land where we just fight endlessly wave after wave of enemies that come out of the woodworks the proverbial woodworks they're just coming out of the woodworks like a, like a bunch of um, wood-eating insects some termites you've got some termites um, your house is made of concrete but it's a special breed of termites that can digest concrete, so they just eat through it. And what you gonna do about it? I don't know. I'm not there. I'm not in your home. So you can't ask me for help. But what are you going to do about all those termites? That is the question, isn't it? Termites. I don't particularly like termites. I mean, I guess they're good for some things. But, uh... I don't know if I'd want to eat them either, but I guess that's the way life is. Um, when life gives you termites, pretend they're rice. <laughs> uh, talking about eating insects uh, makes me a little bit hungry. I haven't eaten lunch yet, but uh, I might after making this video and perhaps one more. So let's wait some time. Go to another battle, and let's see if I can give you a better song. I mean, that last song, I mean, the quality of that, personally, I gotta say, it's not 8 out of 8, mate. It's not 8, of, uh, eight out of 8. I'd say maybe a, a 2 or a 3. Could go better, much better. I mean, I've got the mind, got the voice, just no preparation on that. No prep whatsoever and that's why that song was terrible okay hold that position I'll be with you in a minute just coming up the stairs so the battle rages on I have come to pwn but then the enemies come swarming in. The enemy comes swarming in. My voice cracked a little bit there. So now I must go to fight those evil enemies that come to kill and plunder and pillage all my lands. My lands, my lands, all the lands. So what am I to do about this evil plague of enemies? Probably hit the olive. Yeah, I did. Got to ease up. Ease up on the on our pot shots. There you go. Let's take him out. You get a car. And you get a car! And you get a car! Everybody gets a car! Yeah, that's right. 
You get a car. You get a car. Everybody gets a car. And uh, that's my Oprah Winfrey impression for today. Oh no, they're flanking us. Charge! Wait, are those our guys? No, they're not. We're being flanked. No. Oh no! That's right, I kicked you. What you gonna do about that, huh? Gonna kick me back like some big noob? No! I say no! Say no to drugs! That's right, no cocaine for me! Cocaine is bad for you! I mean... If, if you have cocaine, I mean, seriously, dude. Don't, don't, don't even try to share it with me. I, I'll just say no. Say no to drugs, uh, because if you get addicted, you become a slave to it, you know? It's like saying, yeah, I'm, I'm not a slave to any other man, but I'm a slave to an inanimate object. That's right. Don't get addicted. It's, uh, it's bad. You know? Addiction is, is just one of those things that, that's bad. I mean, if you have a friend that's addicted, you gotta help. Always help people. Helping people is always a good thing to do. Can't really jump over these. Okay. Just, just checking. <laughs> oh my goodness, the wounded on my side. Pretty bad, I gotta say. But, at least only four died. Oh, my Olive got wounded. That'll be... Oh no, a Sister of Mercy got killed as well. And a Cannoneer again? Alright. Well, I guess... Guess haters gonna hate. So, I need to redo my garrison. Get some more archers. I can't upgrade anyone, so I won't get any of the lower level units. And the reason I can't upgrade them is because I've got no money. No money whatsoever, to be exact. I mean, I mean I've got 118, but I can't upgrade anyone with that. Well, I can't upgrade you. So, in fact, if I just do this for a second... Party. Gotta make sure I don't click on anything. Let's talk Bunduk. Let's have a fireside chat. Yes, brother, he tells me. And I'm all, uh, let's talk about your skills. All right. Let's see. One attribute point. In fact, he's our healer, so might as well. Wound treatment, I think we'll need that. First aid, not so much in this battle. However, surgery, very important. Throwing skills, have some. Okay, Artemir. Let's talk, buddy. Tell me about your skills. Okay. He's our engineer. And... Engineer's intelligence and also our backup medic. So let's get some intelligence in him. Another engineer point. Some wound treatment. And how about you get some uh, toughness? Stay tough, my friend. Stay tough. Let's give you some attribute points. And uh, that's enough for him. Wait here for some time. And again they come. And is it me or 
are their numbers just increasing over time? I mean, what's the deal here? It's like an endless battle. We lose people from time to time, but eventually we get reinforcements from the town. They lose people, but there's just so many of them. It doesn't matter. <laughs> it doesn't matter how many they lose. Oh, come on. Come on. Go on. Give me some, some space. Not spice. Um, if you know who the Spice Girls are, then you're probably older than I am. <laughs> I mean, before my time, in fact, I don't really watch that much. Uh, do they make music videos back then? Yeah, they probably did. I don't listen that much to Spice Girls. I don't know why I even mentioned it. But, uh, I guess it is something. Something mentionable. Go on. Wait. No, are those my guys? My olive is there, isn't it? No, no, it's not, because it got knocked out. Never mind, I can shoot at these guys. There's a friendly troop in there. Uh, I keep hitting my friendly troops. What is going on? No, the enemy. Trying to flank us once more. Well, I'll, I'll give your taste of some rainbow that you probably won't like. It's a double rainbow. Uh, own, son. Get some more rainbow. All right. Holding the fort. Six killed. Two wounded, one wounded on the allies. I'm probably partially responsible for the ones on our side that got killed. Which actually bears greatly on my conscience, even though it's just a video game. Because, oh, Rocketeer, that's even worse than losing Cannoneers. Uh, it just bears on my conscience, in a sense, that, I mean... I promised these men, well I didn't promise them, but I have a duty to these men, an obligation, an obligation to lead them to victory, because if I do not lead them to victory, it is likely that most, if not all of these fine men and women will die, and I don't want that, I don't want all my buddies to die because to be honest do you want all your buddies to die probably not so for that same reason I don't want all my buddies to die let's see still have plenty of Praetorians so uh, let's see what's at the marketplace well no not the marketplace the tavern let's have a look around see what's up What's down, what's left, what's right, front, back, all the directions, even diagonals, ellipses, um, parabolas, circles, squares, rectangles, all the different shapes. Watchman, Curve and Guard. I can't recruit any of these. I mean, I could, but much good that would do me. And by much, I mean none. No good at all. These guys, they might have a fighting spirit. They saw all the men fighting on the front line, and they decided, we want to help our country. 
It's only one city and a few villages, but we nonetheless want to help our country to keep it safe and free from the evils of exploiting people and other bad things. And you know what? I commend you. I commend all of you. You watchmen and caravan guards and townsmen and even you wandering minstrel. I commend all of you for being here because you being here it just makes life just one step better. Things just get one step up. And you know, you are what makes this, this land great. You who come and you choose to give your life for the protection of the land, even though you are outnumbered 10 to 1, perhaps even 20 to 1. Even in situations where you would be outnumbered 1,000 to 1, you choose, I will protect my land because that is the right thing to do. And that is honorable. You all, you all have honor. You all have a great degree of honor. I, on the other hand, I am glad. I am glad to live in this city with you. You make this all worthwhile. The people like you is who we fight for. We fight for people who know their country, who want the freedom that we have. We want the liberty and the honor and also the love because man, man I, I love you guys you're the best totally platonic still love you it's amazing so now I resolve that I will defend this city to the death Of the enemies. <laughs> Let them bring their entire kingdom on us. Let them fall upon us with every man, woman, and child, and elderly put to arms. And we will. We will fight like we've never fought before. We will fight as men. And noble women as well. We will fight to protect that which we have built in this short time. We will fight to protect that which those who have come before us have given up their lives for. We will fight to protect our future and the future of those who will come after us. And that, my friends, that is what we fight for. To battle! Yes. I have the vigor to fight a million men. Of course, not all at once, because, you know, that's taking it a little bit too far. So, my men, let us fight like we have never fought before. Let us fight with honor and truth. And the will to keep on going when things aren't going our way. Let us fight for the victory of all our days at the future, past and present. The enemy comes with many men, but our hearts have strength. We fight today to the last man of the enemy Because they come with hate in their hearts To kill us now, we will defeat them Even if we die, our honor has brought us farther than those who chose to give up 
when things got hard to give up when life was at its sin to give up when you know fear but we choose to stand and fight like men yes we are men we choose to stand and fight even when the enemy has come to take us down we choose to fight to the last man we choose this honor we choose to do this for our future children our sons and daughters oh he's one of our guys we will fight if it is the end we will fight if it is their end we will fight if it is our end we will fight and we will lose because in the end we will win we will fight Where is he? Where, where is it? Where is that bugger gun? Oh, okay. Oh, you're taking a shot. What? You're taking a shot. Well, how about I take a shot at you, huh? Leave my man alone. That's what you get. Get a fine slice of death. Look at his body just spread out everywhere. Yeah. Victory is ours. Only one casualty. Well, one fatal casualty. Several wounded. But... It's good. Wow, the enemy had three lord... What? Yeah, three lords up in that fight. We took them all down, didn't we? Oh, yes, we did. All right. Well, this episode ends here. See you all next time. Goodbye. Goodbye.